So, um, congratulations to all those winners. Uh, very, very, very well deserved. Uh, there are a few more awards here, um, and in, if you, by, by the way, show of hands, um, <clears throat> how many people, this is not your first President's Club? Show of hands, how many people have been here? More than once, okay, all right, good, 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 good. And if this is your first time, and you're wondering how do I get back here, I would encourage you to have a very direct conversation with your manager and make that your talking point. I mean that sincerely. <laughs> no, there, there are people here that have been here multiple times, and they have had those conversations in their performance reviews, and they've said, this is what I want, right? This is how I do it. And I would say, don't be shy about wanting to be back here, um, and make that a talking point with your managers. And if your manager says, how dare you ask that question? Say, Craig told me to ask you the question. <laughs> that was awesome. But I mean, I mean that. I, I think there's nothing wrong with that at all. Um, I think that's awesome. Set goals for yourselves. If this is one of your goals, set it and, uh, and have sort of the action steps and, and, and milestone goals to get there. But if you've been here before, welcome back. Um, and uh, you will remember there are a couple, two special words that we hand out uh, at the end of, of this. Um, and if you've not been here before, these are two special awards. We've actually added a third award this year as well. Um, so giving a little uh, history here, in 2017 going into 2018, over a span of seven months, we lost three Andy Mac family members. So it was, it was devastating for us as a group, um, and all of them were sudden. Everything, not that there's death, one death is different than the other, but it was three sudden deaths within the span of from like the end of December to early July. Um, and those, uh, those folks were uh, President's Club winners at one point in time. So um, the two awards that we've given out are the Colleen Brunell Award and the Jason Miles Award. Um, and this year we're adding at least in Pagliazzo Award as well. So we have three special awards. Each one of these awards is given to somebody that represents or embodies what that person did and what their, what their role was and how they, how they operated. And, and, and each, each of those people were just awesome, awesome people, just like each and every one of you. So um, Colleen Burnell Award, um, and some of the, so I wanna tell you some of the uh, winners from years past. So a couple people that have won these awards, and this isn't everybody, uh, but Gina Petralia has won an award. Karina um, has won this award in the past. Uh, Joel Talent has won, um, and Adam Burke is another one. And there, there are a few others that have won too, just a couple that came to mind uh, when we were off stage here, people that have won these awards in the past. So you win this award, you're, you're definitely in some really, really good company. Uh, Colleen Vernell was our first vendor manager. Um, she was, uh, she came in, we never had a vendor manager before. Um, we didn't really know exactly what the role was. We just like heard that you, you really need one, you need, and, and for good reason. Um, and she really set it up for us, and she, she set it up and she educated us, and that's not really uncommon, right? To somebody um, kind of pioneer something. When you're in a growing company, you don't have all these roles right away, and you kind of grow and you evolve, and, and that's what happened. And she, she was awesome. And so Colleen was somebody, she's like one of those people that she was the one person that did the job, Nobody even knew how she did her job, um, and but then she came to a President's Club, and I remember, never forget, like who's was at, uh, up in Crystal Springs, and uh, her five o'clock West came out, and it was awesome. <laughs> it was such a fun time. Uh, she was really awesome, um, and so you know she she represented that that, that award um, was given to what we somebody who was was an absolute stickler for detail, somebody that was very meticulous. Um, and, uh, and then what we later learned was somebody that also could have a really good time. Um, and, so, um, and so this year's winner, uh, remember the, the qualities are somebody who really does something that uh, you know, nobody else really can do, right? Somebody who sort of stands out in that, uh, somebody who's very detail oriented, really makes a change, pioneers, um, can also have a really good time. And I think after this week, um, and obviously we picked this award, this award winner before, um, but this person really uh, showed that they deserve this award. Uh, please uh, join me in congratulating Sean McNair. MVP when he came up here. We were jumping like, I think he might be like the MVP of this, of this trip. He's, he really came out of the show. <laughs> <laughs> Last time I saw him, is he had like a tight fade too. Like, I mean, that's all. <laughs> um, so uh, Jason, Jason Miles uh, is this next award winner. And unfortunately, the winner of, of this award is not here tonight. Uh, but I do want to talk just a minute about Jason and sort of the award. So Jason um, and, and 
for you know for those we've talked a bunch of us have talked and, and I think Dan's looking to potentially do a, a triathlon and, and, and Scott that's all Scott does is he does a triathlon every day um, <laughs> and, and, uh, and, and so uh, this this gentleman Jason Miles uh, he loved to do active stuff too but he was he was a very very unique very dynamic individual he's awesome awesome guy he, he, he did races and stuff like that and um, you know, he would, he would just do anything. Like he would just like go on a trip to Europe and just like yeah. he'll do it like next week by himself. Like he was just a, but just an awesome, awesome guy. And what he did was um, he did a lot of our credit policy stuff. So a lot of stuff that is sort of Julie's world right now. Uh, Jason did again, kind of one of those like first first person in the organization doing it. I remember interviewing Jason, um, and and I, I was like, I don't know what you're gonna do here, but I know you're gonna work here because you're just an awesome dude. Like there's just something here. Like you're, we're gonna figure it out because you yeah. just gotta hire good people. You're a good person. Um, and then what was awesome about him is that he had these relationships with people, and he didn't he didn't like showcase it. He wasn't like you know it wasn't like the Facebook guy like where. What's the new one? MySpace? What is that? No, <laughs> <laughs> um, but, you know, he, he just had these connections with people that weren't superficial. They were genuine. They were real. And you actually didn't even know they existed. Um, and, and some of them I didn't know existed until his celebration of life, right? And it's just like the number of people and the stories that people have about him. He was a really, really great guy. He touched a lot of people. He did some really, really good work. Um, and so this year we gave that award to Kathleen Dixon. So... <laughs> with Kathleen, you'll know how appropriate that award is. So congratulations, and please uh, you know, shoot, shoot Kathleen a, a text or an email if you could. Um, all right, so this last one is the new award this year. Um, and, uh, and this is Lisa Pagliazzo. Um, Lisa was awesome, one of a kind. Um, she, she was, uh, I really, really enjoyed Lisa personally. Like she, she was a straight shooter. Um, she would just tell you how it is. Just awesome. She's, she was our funding manager. Um, she was the one-man show. Uh, she did it all um, when we were growing. So we had one funder for like 600 units a month, right? Scott, something like it's something crazy, and she just did it. Uh, I don't know how she did. It, she just did. It. And, and then you know, you talk to other companies, they're like, you know, you do. Said, how many funders you have? Like four. Like oh, we had Lisa. Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have to meet her. She's amazing, um, and she was. She was really just an amazing individual. Um, and uh, and and so you know, we wanted to find you know somebody here that was amazing, um, straight shooter, uh, really just very consistent, greater the job, uh, you know, that, that one man band, right? That person, that one person that just basically is an entire department. Uh, so join me in congratulating Sam Riley. <laughs> Or something, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yes. 